you're a contractor in work at all in concrete, you're very familiar with trying to become OSHA Table 1 compliant. Well, Bosch has come out with a new vacuum that is 17 gallon, 300 CFM, that's going to help you get through some of those situations where you might need to put more than one person on a job while they're grinding and also become compliant with a very affordable vacuum. Now this is model number GAS20-17A, as we stated it's a 17 gallon 300 CFM dust collection system. It has a 17.5 amp motor so it does have a 20 amp plug that's going to limit you in your residential situations but this is really meant for more of an industrial commercial application. It does say on the outside that it is HEPA ready but inside it comes with a HEPA filter so you're completely ready to be table one compliant right off the bat. Now OSHA states that you should have 25 CFM of vacuum per inch of grinder. Now we were using this with a nine inch grinder in a very, very aggressive wheel and we had zero issues with the vacuum keeping up. And as we drop down to less aggressive wheels, I know it's not OSHA compliant, but this vacuum could very easily keep up to two nine inch grinders, although we cannot say that and it can't be OSHA compliant that way. It is compliant to run two five inch grinders off this and we also had this hooked up to a larger wheeled grinder and we had zero issues with it pulling the epoxy out and grinding the surface of the concrete. This unit worked awesome and we used bags on the inside to try to keep things a little bit more clean and have some easier cleanup. Now the bags that come with this vacuum are fairly small when you look at the size of the, the vacuum on the inside. So once these get about half full, like with any other vacuum, you start to lose a little bit of suction. Uh, but the reality was cleaning up with these bags was so much easier as you just pulled the bag out and then could take care of it without exposing yourself to any more dust. Now this unit will work with either the auto filter cleaner on where it will pound that filter every 15 seconds and keep everything clean or you can just turn it on without the filter cleaning and it will clean the filter as you turn it off. If you're using this vacuum in a wet condition it will automatically turn off when the vacuum fills up with water. Draining this vacuum is very simple. There is a drain on the back that you can just remove from its holder, lay in the ground, pull it out, and it'll allow the water to drain out. If you want to remove the whole canister from the vacuum, there's just two levers in the back to pull, and you can lift this whole vacuum off its mobile base to take it and clean it. The HEPA filter is easily accessed from the top, so you can take that out and replace it when needed. A lot of things in this Bosch vacuum are very similar to some of their smaller models, but this is a very beefy and very industrial vacuum that still is not overly loud. And I think that's one of the big benefits to some of these newer dust extractors is that you don't have a noise inside a small area, but you still have the large amount of CFM getting moved through the vacuum. So if you're out looking for something that is affordable, uh, there's a couple places that have this vacuum right now. It is $1,499 and probably as it gets out further, that price might come down a little bit on the street. But for any contractor looking, this is going to be one of the more affordable dust extraction systems on the market that brings 300 CFM. At that price, this vacuum will come set up for use with one hose. You can buy this Y adapter that will connect to the front and an extra hose if you need to run two grinders on it. This is gonna be set up mostly for concrete, but I can see some higher end woodworkers really diving into something that they want this extra flow for single tools that are out there. Not many, but I think there's a niche market that will go for it. So if you're in the market for a new dust extractor for your concrete work, make sure you give Bosch a look. Make sure you subscribe to this channel and give us a like on this video. Also follow us on social media. Thanks for your time. Have a great day.